If you took the NVIDIA Shield and combined it with the NVIDIA Tegra Note tablet and then upgraded everything, you'd have the NVIDIA Shield tablet. The NVIDIA Shield has an 8 inch screen with a 1920 by 1200 resolution. It also houses a 2.2 gigahertz Tegra K1 with a 192 core GPU. The tablet runs Android KitKat, has dual front facing speakers, a 5 megapixel front facing camera, and a 5 megapixel back camera. And just like the Tegra Note 7, it also includes a stylus. It also includes a micro USB port, a mini HDMI port, and a micro SD card port that supports up to 128 gigabyte cards. Now the tablet is a fully functional tablet, but the controller this time is optional. It costs $59 and it feels a lot lighter than the original NVIDIA Shield, of course, because there's no screen now. Uh, the buttons have a nice resistance to them. The triggers feel nice. The bumper buttons feel pretty good. Uh, and the face buttons are pretty snappy. The analog controls have a good amount of resistance and the control pad is a little bit loose for my taste, but still feels a little nice. The NVIDIA Shield tablet is coming to the US on July 29th. Europe in mid-August and look for it in other territories sometime in 2014. It'll cost $299 with 16 gigabytes for the Wi-Fi version and $399 with 32 gigabytes for the LTE version. I'm Eric Franklin and this has been a first look at the NVIDIA Shield tablet.